Hello everyone, myself Rameshwari Holkar and I am Centre Head at Excel Swiss Academy in Hyderabad. In today's session, we are going to learn about the very important independent river system. But I will give you one clue. I want you to study this map and identify which one of the river I haven't covered in the previous classes. So whoever has followed my session very sincerely and regularly, they must have whispered the answer and the answer is river Barak. We haven't covered the Barak because Barak river is not part of the Brahmaputra river system. So let's, it's very interesting session to study about the Barak river. So Barak river originate in the Manipur state from the Manipur hill. Then it flows between the border of Manipur and Mizoram and then it enter to the region of this Assam. You can see through this map, it's very interesting to see. So this is the flow of Barak river from the Manipur hill, from the Manipur state it originate and then it flows southwestern direction from the Manipur state. As it touch to the border of Meghalaya, it takes in Tixical upward U-turn. You can see this here also and enter in the state of Assam. Now, a very interesting fact to learn about the physiography of this region. So here, it get covered literally by the three side with these three important hill ranges. In the another side, you can see this Barel range. In the eastern side, we have a Manipur hill from where it actually originate and from the southern side, Lushai hill range. Lushai hill range is there in the region of this Mizoram. So, three side, there are three hill ranges, Lushai hills, Manipur hill, at the same time, Barel hill range. So, from this three, it literally create like a wall for this river and then this river create enters in the region or the in the country of Bangladesh it get it bifurcated when it bifurcated there are two distributaries get formed by this river the name of this distributaries are Kushiara and Surma river so if you are following very religiously the newspaper and Indo Bangladesh relation you will get to know about this Kushiara river because Kushiara river is one of the disputed river basin between these two countries along with the river Tista. So now this Kushiara river and Surma river enters in the region of this Bangladesh and then it meet or it confluence with this river Padma. Right and after confluencing with river Padma it is called as a river Meghna. And this finally creates one of the beautiful or world's one of the largest delta, Gangatic Delta. Now you can see and understand this through this map as well. Also remember few of the important information that this river create different river patterns. Like it can create a Dendric river pattern, it create a trellis river pattern as well as parallel river pattern. Right. So this is the map of this river Tista, sorry, um, Barak. This is physiographical map of this river Barak. Also study by studying the river system, study the physiography of that region. This is the flow of this river Barak and this is final pic picture. You can see where the Ganga, Brahmaputra and Barak river finally drain out in the region of this Bangladesh. So there are two tributaries or distributaries of the Barak is Kushiara, Surma, Brahmaputra, there is a Tista right and there is important is the Ganga and now together everyone is known as a Meghna and it forms the Gangetic Delta. So it's very interesting fact to learn about this river Barak. So there are some MCQs that we are going to solve. So if you are very confident that you don't want to go through the classes or you don't want to go through the video sessions, you can directly solve these MCQs as well. But don't forget to comment your answer or ans drop your answer in the comment box below. The first question that we have is the Barak river flows through Assam, Manipur, Nagaland. Select the correct code 1, 2, 2, 3, 1, 3 and all of the above. So even though the question may seem to be easy at this moment, if you have heard this session very carefully, but believe me during the examination, it may get very, very confused. Second question that we have. This river is a part of Surma Meghna river system and forms the international boundary with the neighboring countries of India. It flows from Barel Hill in north, Lushai Hills to the east. This river is not tributary 
of any of the major rivers of India. Which of the following river justify the above description? Option first, river Meghana, river Manipur, river Dhanasiri and river Barak. I am sure that you know this answer 100%. Now, the second, third important question is that we have India and Bangladesh share many rivers and creating one of the world's best delta by the confluence of many rivers. In this context, consider the following statement. First, river Brahmaputra and Tista confluence is known as the Jamuna River. Second, river Jamuna and Ganga confluence known as Padma River. And third, river Padma and river Barak known as Madhumati River. Which of the statements given above is our correct in this context. Only one, only two, both one and two. I will change the options now itself. For the A, we will keep it like one and three. For B, we will keep two and three. For C, we will keep one, two and three. And with the D, we will keep only one. I will make changes in the description of this video itself. So, this will be the three questions related with the Barak River. I hope you are understanding this session and enjoying this river system. Stay tuned. Thank you so much.